I suppose we'll just touch on the on the demons for a second, Anthony. We all, I suppose, have a demon somewhere or another. But um, can you explain a wee bit uh, an example about that, Anthony, of what's covered in, in the book in that in that regard? Yeah, well, you know, without a doubt, like you know, um, first of all, Tony, uh, you know, there was a huge drinking culture around the J, like in my time playing, and uh, you know, uh, the players and spectators alike, and uh, you know, when you played when you played a club game or a county game back in the M days, you know, you went to the pub. And uh, you're there most of the time, probably till closing time. And and um, you see, I suppose me being me, like I I thought that I had to um, uh, mix and 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 speak to my supporters and that there. And 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 uh, you know, there were drink probably coming from all angles as well. Like, and I never refused. And and uh, but that's the way it was, you know. And and like uh, went out then, like the following day, like and you ran that off, like. Uh, Doing done the miles around the field, like and ran it out of the system, and but you know when I retired, um, again when I retired, uh, I went through a difficult period in my life as well, like and and uh, sort of lost my way, and and uh, most the reason being, you know, I wasn't ready for retirement uh, or I wasn't prepared. Probably is the better word for it, you know, for retirement. Um, all of a sudden, uh, there was a huge vacuum in my life, um, you know. There's no more games, no more training, no more discipline, no more cheers, uh, running out onto fields and that there. And uh, I found that hard to deal with. And, and <clears throat> then I found myself, you know, going to the pub more oftener. And uh, but I was lonely at the time, probably, you know, and, and, and uh, as well, because I missed the lads, you know, that I was used to to meeting uh, week in, week out and that there. But, you know, thankfully, <clears throat> you know, I got professional help. Um I went to AA and uh, meetings and all that there around that time, and uh, I learned a lot about myself. Uh, I learned a lot about living, uh, and uh, I suppose uh, I'm still learning about living, and uh, it's, it's it's a work in progress every day, I think. And, um, you know, <clears throat> I was a sort of a fella, Tony, like that uh, couldn't say no. Uh, I was afraid of uh, what people uh, thought of me uh, if I made a speech, uh, what people thought of a speech. Uh, you know, silly nonsense like that there. And, 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 and uh, But I learned and, you know, I read a lot of inspirational, positive books around that time as well. And, and uh, But I learned a lot about, you know, what makes Anthony Malloy tick, you know. And, and, and uh, thankfully, you know, I've got, I, I've got over and put that bad, bad period behind me. Yeah, well, I'm definitely glad to hear that, Anthony. And as I say, you you seek help. You did the right thing, and I suppose, Anthony, that's a there's a, there's a kind of a you know a stigma attached to that. You know, and even today, where a lot of uh, men, uh, more so men, aren't really coming forward, maybe about how they're feeling, and you know, a show it's a sign of strength, really, to ask for help. Oh, without a doubt, too, Tony, because. Uh you know uh, the the shame and that there, like and uh, you know afraid, uh, you know afraid to talk to somebody back in the day was well, there, like and uh, uh, you know thankfully that's not there today. You know the young people today, like this, you know they talk more openly, like and uh, look, I'm not one bit of shame, like that uh, that, that uh, I went to meetings that I sought professional help on one bit, like and today, um, you know I'm my own man today. Uh, I'm not afraid what people think of me the day like uh, I speak my mind the day and if people are not happy with it well as long as Anthony Malloy's happy with it uh, that's okay you know but also you know today as well Tony like um, you've got the GPA there now and you've got the the whole set up is a totally professional set up today you know these players the modern players you know they have all sorts of medical backup and all sorts of different backups there for them like and the GA as well provide a lot of assistance as well there with uh, people with addic- addictions or whatever or even they're even putting lads back to school and all that there like and they're a fantastic organisation but you know that wasn't there in my time and the people of my era they were more closed as well like and they were afraid to talk about their troubles uh, to anybody and in, in, uh, you know, but thankfully that's not the way it is today, Tony. You know. Yeah, thank thankfully that's the case, uh, Anthony. And 